Montpelier French, M. Plia, P. Listen, Occitan, Montpelier Montpellier is a city in southern France. It is the capital of the Aero department. Montpelier is the seventh largest city of France, and is also the fastest growing city in the country over the past 25 years. In 2014, 589,610 people live in the urban area and 275,318 in the city itself. Nearly one-third of the population are students from three universities and from three higher education institutions that are outside the university framework in the city. Located near the south coast of France on the Mediterranean Sea, it is the third largest French city on the Mediterranean coast after Marseille and Nice. History Medieval period In the early Middle Ages, the nearby episcopal town of Miguelone was the major settlement in the area, but raids by pirates encouraged settlement a little further inland. Montpelier, first mentioned in a document of 985, was founded under a local feudal dynasty, the Guilhem, who combined two hamlets and built a castle and walls around the united settlement. The two surviving towers of the city walls, the Tour des Pins and the Tour de la Babette, were built later, around the year 1200. Montpelier came to prominence in the 12th century as a trading center, with trading links across the Mediterranean world, and a rich Jewish cultural life that flourished within traditions of tolerance of Muslims, Jews, and Cathars and later of its Protestants. William VIII of Montpelier gave freedom for all to teach medicine in Montpelier in 1180. The city's faculties of law and medicine were established in 1220 by Cardinal Conrad of Uric, legate of Pope Honorius III. The medicine faculty has, over the centuries, been one of the major centers for the teaching of medicine in Europe. This era marked the high point of Montpelier's prominence. The city became a possession of the kings of Aragon in 1204 by the marriage of Peter II of Aragon with Marie of Montpelier, who was given the city and its dependencies as part of her dowry. Montpelier gained a charter in 1204 when Peter and Marie confirmed the city's traditional freedoms and granted the city the right to choose twelve governing consuls annually. Under the kings of Aragon, Montpelier became a very important city, a major economic centre and the primary centre for the spice trade in the Kingdom of France. It was the second or third most important city of France at that time, with some 40,000 inhabitants before the Black Death. Montpelier remained a possession of the Crown of Aragon until it passed to James III of Majorca, who sold the city to the French King Philip VI in 1349, to raise funds for his ongoing struggle with Peter IV of Aragon. In the 14th century, Pope Urban VIII gave Montpelier a new monastery dedicated to St. Peter, noteworthy for the very unusual porch of its chapel, supported by two high, somewhat rocket-like towers. With its importance steadily increasing, the city finally gained a bishop, who moved from Miguelone in 1536, and the huge monastery chapel became a cathedral. In 1432, Jacques Coeur established himself in the city and it became an important economic centre, until 1481 when Marseille overshadowed it in this role. After the Reformation At the time of the Reformation in the 16th century, many of the inhabitants of Montpelier became Protestants or Huguenots as they were known in France and the city became a stronghold of Protestant resistance to the Catholic French crown. In 1622, King Louis XIII besieged the city which surrendered after a two-month siege, siege of Montpelier, afterwards building the citadel of Montpelier to secure it. Louis XIV made Montpelier capital of Bas Languedoc, and the town started to embellish itself, by building the Promenade du Peru, the Esplanade and a large number of houses in the historic centre. After the French Revolution, the city became the capital of the much smaller Aero. <laughs> Modern history During the 19th century the city thrived on the wine culture that it was able to produce due to the abundance of sun throughout the year. The wine consumption in France allowed Montpelier's citizens to become very wealthy until in the 1890s a fungal disease had spread amongst the vineyards and the people were no longer able to grow the grapes needed for wine. 
After this the city had grown because it welcomed immigrants from Algeria and other parts of northern Africa after Algeria's independence from France. In the 21st century Montpellier is between France's number 7th and 8th largest city. The city had another influx in population more recently, largely due to the student population, who make up about one-third of Montpellier's population. The School of Medicine is what kickstarted the city's thriving university culture, however many other universities have been well established in the coastal city that has developments such as the Corum and the Antigone that too have been drawing in more and more students. Lords of Montpelier William I of Montpelier died 1019 William II of Montpelier died 1025 William III of Montpelier died 1058 William IV of Montpelier died 1068 William V of Montpelier died 1121 William VI of Montpelier died 1149 William the Seventh of Montpelier died 1179. William the Eighth of Montpelier died 1202. Marie of Montpelier died 1213. And King Peter the Second of Aragon died 1213. James the First of Aragon died 1276. James the Second of Majorca died 1311. James the Third of Majorca died 1349. Topic. Geography The city is situated on hilly ground 10 km 6 miles inland from the Mediterranean coast on the river Les. The name of the city, which was originally Montspicillanus, is said to have stood for Mont Pele the naked hill, because the vegetation was poor, or La Mont de la Colline the mount of the hill. Montpellier is located 170 kilometers 106 miles from Marseille, 242 kilometers 150 miles from Toulouse, and 748 kilometers 465 miles from Paris. Montpellier's highest point is the Place du Peru, at an altitude of 57 meters 187 feet. The city is built on two hills, Montpellier and Montpellieret, thus some of its streets have great differences of altitude. Some of its streets are also very narrow and old, which gives it a more intimate feel. Topic: <inaudible> Climate. Montpellier has a Mediterranean climate, Köppen CSA, with mild damp winters and hot rather dry summers. The monthly mean ranges from 7.1 degrees Celsius (44.8 degrees Fahrenheit) in January to 23.4 degrees Celsius (74.1 degrees Fahrenheit) in July. Precipitation is around 660 mm (26.0 in) and is greatest in fall and winter, but not absent in summer either. Extreme temperatures have ranged from -17.8 degrees Celsius (-0.04 degrees Fahrenheit) recorded on February 5, 1963, and up to 37.5 degrees Celsius (99.5 degrees Fahrenheit) on July 17, 1990. Topic: Neighborhoods. <inaudible> 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 Since 2001, Montpelier has been divided into seven official neighborhoods, themselves divided into sub-neighborhoods. Each of them possesses a neighborhood council. Montpelier Center, Historical Center Acusson, Comedy, Gares, Faubourg Boutonnet, Saint Charles, Faubourg Saint Jean, Peru, Les Arso, Figueroles, Faubourg du Coro, Gambetta, Clemenceau, Mediterranée, Boulevard de Strasbourg, Le Triangle, Polygon, Antigone, Nouveau Monde, Parc à Balance, Les Abis, Les Beaux Arts, Saint Lazare. Croix d'Argent, Avenue de Toulouse, Croix d'Argent, Mas Dravon, Tastevin, Lamassin, Garassad, Mas de Bagnères, Mas Nouguier, Les Sabines, Lepic, Pa du Lou, Astanov, Les Buises, Val de Crozes, Bagatelle. Les Savennes, Les Savennes, Alco, La Petite Barde, Pergola, Saint Clement, Clementville, Las Rebes, La Chamberte, La Martel, Montpelier Village, Les Grisettes, Les Grezes. Mossen, La Mossen, Selnov, La Pilade, Les Hautes de Massane, La Grande Mail, Les Tritons. 
Hopito Facultés, Malbosc, Saint Priest, Euromedecini, Zolid, Plan des Four Seigneurs, Hopito, IUT, Persoulas, Universites, Vert Bois, Hautes de Boutonnet, Aigoulong, Justice, Parc Zoologique de Lunare, Agropolis. Port Marianne, La Pompinane, Richter, Millinaire, Jacques Kerr, Consuls de Mer, Gramont, Odysseum, Montaberu, La Meyanelle, Cambacers. Praise Darines, Les Praise Darines, Avenue de Palavas, La Rouse, Tournesy, Saint Martin, Les Aigarelles, Pont Trinquet, Cite Mion. Population The whole metropolitan area had a population of 510,400 in 2006. In 2011, the estimated population of the metropolitan area was 561,326, for most of its history, and even today, Montpelier is known for its significant Spanish population, heritage and influence. Montpelier also houses important Moroccan, Algerian, and Italian communities. Topic Heraldry Topic Sites The main focus point of the city is the Place de la Comédie, with the Opera Comédie built in 1888. The Musée Fabre In the historic centre, a significant number of hotels particuliers i.e. mansions can be found. The majority of the buildings of the historic centre of Montpelier called the Acusson because its shape is roughly that of an escutcheon have medieval roots and were modified between the 16th and the 18th centuries. Some buildings, along Rue Folk and the Place de la Comédie, were built in the 19th century. The Rue du Bras de Fer Iron Arm Street is very typical of the medieval Montpelier. The Mikveh, ritual Jewish bath, dates back to the 12th century and is one of very few in Europe. The Jardin des Plantes de Montpelier, oldest botanical garden in France, founded in 1593. The La Serre Amazonienne, a tropical rainforest greenhouse. The 14th century Saint Pierre Cathedral. The Porte du Peru, a triumphal arch built at the end of the 17th century, and the Place Royal du Peru built in the 17th century, are the highest point of the Ecosant. The Tour des Pins, the only remaining of 25 towers of the city medieval walls, built around 1200. The Tour de la Babette, a medieval tower which was modified in the 18th century to house an observatory. The Saint Clement Aqueduct, built in the 18th century. The Antigone district and other housing projects have been designed by the architect Ricardo Bofal from Catalonia, Spain. A number of chateaux, so-called follies, built by wealthy merchants surround the city. Nearly 80 private mansions were built in the city from the 17th to 19th century, and some of their interior courtyards are open. Education History The University of Montpelier is one of the oldest in the world, founded in 1160, and having been granted a charter in 1220 by Cardinal Conrad von Urich and confirmed by Pope Nicholas IV in a papal bull of 1289. It was suppressed during the French Revolution but was re-established in 1896. It is not known exactly at what date the schools of literature were founded which developed into the Montpelier Faculty of Arts, it may be that they were a direct continuation of the Gallo-Roman schools. The School of Law was founded by Placentinus, a doctor from Bologna University, who came to Montpelier in 1160, taught there during two different periods, and died there in 1192. The School of Medicine was founded perhaps by a graduate of the Muslim Spain medical schools. It is certain that, as early as 1137, there were excellent physicians at Montpelier. The statutes given in 1220 by Cardinal Conrad, legate of Honorius III, which were completed in 1240 by Pierre de Conques, placed this school under the direction of the Bishop of Magalone. Pope Nicholas IV issued a bull in 1289, combining all the schools into a university, which was placed under the direction of the bishop, but which in fact enjoyed a large measure of autonomy. Theology was at first taught in the convents, in which St. Anthony of Padua, Raymond Lullis, and the Dominican Bernard de la Trey lectured. 
Two letters of King John prove that a faculty of theology existed at Montpelier independently of the convents, in January 1350. By a bull of 17 December 1421, Martin V granted canonical institution to this faculty and united it closely with the Faculty of Law. In the 16th century the Faculty of Theology disappeared for a time, when Calvinism, in the reign of Henry II of France, held complete possession of the city. It resumed its functions after Louis XIII had re-established the royal power at Montpelier in 1622, but the rivalries of Dominicans and Jesuits interfered seriously with the prosperity of the faculty, which disappeared at the Revolution. The faculty numbered among its illustrious pupils of La Petrarch, who spent four years at Montpelier, and among its lecturers Guillaume de Nogaret, Chancellor to Philip the Fair, Guillaume de Grimord, afterwards Pope under the name of Urban V, and Pedro de Luna, antipope as Benedict XIII. But after the 15th century this faculty fell into decay, as did also the Faculty of Arts, although for a time, under Henry IV of France, the latter faculty had among its lecturers Casobon. The Montpelier School of Medicine owed its success to the ruling of the Guilhems, lords of the town, by which any licensed physician might lecture there, there was no fixed limit to the number of teachers, lectures were multiplied, and there was a great wealth of teaching. Rabelais took his medical degrees at Montpelier. It was in this school that the biological theory of vitalism, elaborated by Barthes (1734–1806), had its origin. The French Revolution did not interrupt the existence of the Faculty of Medicine. The faculties of science and of letters were re-established in 1810, that of law in 1880. It was on the occasion of the sixth centenary of the university, celebrated in 1889, that the government of France announced its intention, which has since been realized of reorganizing the provincial universities in France. <laughs> universities University of Montpellier 1, Medicine, Dentistry, Pharmacy, Law, Business, Sports Montpellier 2 University, Sciences Paul Valéry University, Montpellier III, Arts, Languages and Social Sciences University of Montpellier I and University of Montpellier II reunified in January 2015 to form the University of Montpellier. Paul Valéry University Montpellier, remains a separate entity. <laughs> Grandes écoles Science Arts École Polytechnique Universitaire de Montpellier Polytech National Superior Architecture School of Montpellier Ensom École Nationale de l'Aviation Civile ENSCM Chemistry École pour l'Informatique et les Nouvelles Technologies Institut Supérieur Européen de Formation par l'Action Montpellier Supergro Agronomy SUPINFO International University, private institution of higher education in general computer science business Montpelier Business School SUPIXUP Higher Education Institute Transport Montpelier is served by railway, including TGV high-speed trains. Montpelier's main railway station is St. Rock. There are plans to construct a high-speed railway linking Nimes and Montpelier with the LGV Méditerranée. The Montpelier – Méditerranée Airport is located in the area of Fréjorgs, in the town of Maguio, southeast of Montpelier. The Transports de l'Agglomération de Montpelier TAM manages the city's public transportation, including its 56-kilometre tramway network consisting of four lines and several parking facilities. Line 1 runs from Mawson in the west to Odysseum in the east. Line 2 runs from Jaco in the northeast to St. Jean de Vedas in the southwest. Line 3 and Line 4 opened in April 2012. Line 3, which is 22.4 km .9 miles long, links Juvignac and Perils with a branch to Lattes and serves 32 stations. Line 4 circles the center and serves as a connector line between the various arms of tram system. They intersect at Gare St. Rock Station, Rives du Les and Corum. The TAM also manages the large bike sharing scheme Velomag, started in June 2007, comprising 1,200 bicycles and 50 stations. <laughs> Sport 
Montpellier was the finish of Stage 11 and the departure of Stage 12 in the 2007 Tour de France, it was also the finish of Stage 11 and the departure of Stage 12 in the 2016 edition. The city is home to a variety of professional sports teams. Montpellier Aero Rugby, of the top 14 who play rugby union formerly at the Stade Sabathé and now at the Altrad Stadium. In the 2010-2011 season, the team made it to the top 14 final against the Stade Toulousain. Montpellier HSC of Ligue 1 who play association football at the Stade de la Masson. MHSC became French champions on May 20, 2012. Montpellier Red Devils who play rugby league in Elite 1 division at the Stade Sabathé. Montpellier Agglomération Handball are a team handball club playing in the French National League. Montpellier Vipers of France's Division I Ice Hockey Federation, play at the Patinoir de l'Agglomération de Montpellier at Odysseum Montpellier Water Polo play in the National League and European Cup competitions. Barracudas de Montpellier is a baseball club, and competes in Division Elite, a French top-level baseball league. Montpellier was one of the hosts of the FIBA Eurobasket 2015. The city is home to the Open Sud de France tennis tournament since 2010, and will host the 31st World Rhythmic Gymnastics Championship. The main athletics stadium is the Philippides Stadium, which is owned by the University of Montpellier. Culture The city is a center for cultural events as there are many students. Montpelier has two large concert venues, La Zenith Sud and Lorena Le Corum Cultural and Conference Center contains three auditoriums. The Festival de Radio France at Montpellier is a summer festival of opera and other music held in Montpellier. The festival concentrates on classical music and jazz with about 150 events, including opera, concerts, films, and talks. Most of these events are free and are held in the historic courtyards of the city or in the modern concert halls of Le Corum. The annual Cinem, the International Mediterranean Film Festival Montpellier, held in the fall, is the second largest French film festival after the Cannes Film Festival. Held since 1979, it offers screenings of over 200 long and short films, documentaries, animated films, trailers, and a special program of student films. Other events include panel discussions, exhibitions, and gatherings. Venues include Le Corum and Cinema Halls. Topic. International relations Topic. Twin towns, sister cities Montpelier is twinned with Topic. Notable people Montpelier was the birthplace of Abraham ben Isaac of Narbonne, c. 1110-1179, rabbi and author of the Halakhic work Ha Eshkel. Saint Rock, 1295-1327, pilgrim to Rome, venerated as a saint by the Roman Catholic Church. Pierre Magnol, 1638-1715, botanist, founder of the concept of plant families. Etienne Hyacinthe de Rat, 1722-1805, mathematician and astronomer. Cyril Rigaud, 1750-1824, poet. Jean-Jacques Régis de Cambacers, 1753-1824, lawyer and statesman, author of the Code Napoléon. Guillaume Mathieu, Comte Dumas, 1753-1837, military leader. Louis Sébastien Lenormand, 1757-1837, chemist, physicist, inventor and the first modern parachuting pioneer in the world. Auguste Comte (1798–1857), a founder of the discipline of sociology. Antoine Jérôme Ballard (1802–1876), chemist. Émile Sayce (1814–1863), philosopher. Charles Bernard Renouvier (1815–1903), philosopher. Édouard Albert Roche (1822–1883), astronomer. Alfred Bruyas 1821 to 1876 art collector 
Alexander Cabanel (1823–1889), painter. Renaud de Vilbac (1829–1884), composer, organist. Frederic Bazille (1841–1870), impressionist painter. Henri Charles Puech (1902–1986), historian of religion. Leo Mallet (1909–1996), crime novelist. Henri Carroll (1910–1984), French composer and organist. Jean Demisieur (1921–1968), organist, pianist, composer, and pedagogue. Monique de Bissy, member of the resistance during World War II (1923–2009). Jean-Luc Dehaene (1940–2014), Prime Minister of Belgium. Didier Auriel, born 1958, rally driver, 1994 World Rally Champion. Rémy Gaillard, born 1975, famous French prankster. Sophie Divry, born 1979, writer, winner of the 2014 Prix Wepler. Suzanne Verdier, 1745–1813, writer. Other famous inhabitants include. François Rabelais (1493–1553), student at the University of Montpellier. Nostradamus (1503–1566), student at the University of Montpellier. Johann Iacob Heraclit, ruler of Moldavia from 1561 to 1563. Pierre Joseph Amoro (1741–1824), zoologist. Jean-Louis Michel 1785 to 1865 fencing master who lived in Montpellier from 1830 onwards Agener Azema de Montgravier 1805 to 1863 deputy director of l'école d'artillerie de Montpellier died in Montpellier in 1863 Gaston Darboux 1842 to 1917 mathematician Hosius Braun Blanquet 1884 to 1980 Jean Moulin 1899 famous French resistant during World War II, studied and worked in Montpellier Alexander Grothendieck 1928 mathematician Nicolas Karabatic born 1984, handball player Paul Valéry student at the University of Montpellier Inver Hoja (1908–1985), student at the University of Montpellier. Gregory Vignal born 1981, Birmingham City FC. Fullback. Taha Hussein (1889–1973), student at the University of Montpellier. Michel Navratil (1908–2001), survivor of the sinking of the RMS Titanic. Guy Delisle, born 1966, Canadian-born cartoonist, animator, and author. Adamantios Corre, 1748–1833, Greek humanist scholar and a major figure in the Greek Enlightenment, studied at the University of Montpellier. Topic: Other locations named after Montpellier. Montpellier is used as the name of other towns and streets in as many as four continents. Many places in England, Scotland, Wales and Ireland carry the name Montpelier. Often they are in resort locations claiming some of the healthy attributes for which the French city was renowned in earlier centuries. The variant spelling, Montpelier, is common, and is of quite early provenance. Brewer uses that spelling. The first example was the early 19th century suburb of Montpelier in Brighton. The capital of the American state of Vermont was named Montpelier because of the high regard in which the Americans held the French who had aided their revolutionary war against the British. Several other American cities are also named Montpelier. Places named Montpeliers. Montpeliers are also found in Australia, Canada, South Africa, and the Caribbean. See also Communes of the Arrow Department Roman Catholic Archdiocese of Montpelier <laughs>